Thursday, it's Easter today on the Long Island Breakfast Club show. I have some great guests today. I want to first introduce Danny. How are you? Baez, how do you pronounce your name? Baez. Baez. I should know. I know him for like five years. That's correct. My favorite place, Casariano Italian Eatery. Giancarlo is the chef. You go there. on. We go there after the show sometimes on a Thursday. There's correct. a big thing tonight. And... Uh, we love it, so thank you for coming, Danny. Thank you. Thank you for having me. My you. other dear friend here, Hi. Tanya from Power Magazine. You yeah. look great. Thank you, so We're going to be talking about a lot of great stuff. I see okay. you bought my favorite magazine today. <laughs> yeah. Power Magazine. Thank you. First time man was on the cover. Wow. I know. <laughs> well, that's a that's good pretty thing. damn good. I know. And Lydia Shepanowski. That is so good. Wow. Well, I, wow. I'm so impressed. I was raised Polish. Okay. My best friend is Polish. Her name is Jerry and her, her maiden name was Watusiak. Uh -huh. So I know how to talk Polish because I went to Polish school. I was that was my first language was Polish. All right. Yeah. Only Italian in a Polish <laughs> school growing yeah. up. Very because nice. Because my father made all the nuns desks because he was a coffee Oh. So we had to Very go nice. there because they got a, like a mm. barter. Yes. So, uh, <laughs> you know, that was it. We went there, there for eight years. School barter. Yeah. So it's nice, nice to see you, but I do recognize you. Because yes. we know each oh, other from our channels. Long Island is a, is a very small place. Yes. It's a big and, place. And uh, we have another place. lady in the audience who will be coming up. And you and her are wearing the same dress. Now, no, how we weird are. is that? Almost. Yeah. We're wearing her dress. You got the memo. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe it. How the hell did that happen? <laughs> Unbelievable. Black is very popular. Yeah. Yes. I didn't get the memo. Yeah, well, you look very handsome. Light blue is my favorite yeah. color on a man. And I like pink yeah. on a man. A pink Absolutely. shirt. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. But, um... People tell me all the time, you wear too much black. But I wear it with colors. Yeah. yeah. But people always tell me, you know, It can things. give me my earring. Yeah, it does. It goes with you. People <laughs> tell me, like, I don't know, is it because when you have a show, people tell you things that maybe you might want to hear? Is that possible? Uh, I think people do that generally anyway. <laughs> 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 if they blow smoke, you know where. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So today is a Major League Baseball opening day. Mm -hmm. And that is something that everyone celebrates. Yeah. And it's... a uh, Today is that special day. And it's so raining. So everybody's <laughs> is raining and everybody's and getting ready out. to play baseball and everything else. And it's Holy Thursday. And it's Holy Thursday. Everybody should be going to church. Yep. And it's also wear a hat day. Now, yeah. I just got my hair done today, so I'm not wearing a hat today. But mm, hats know. cover your hair when it's a you yeah. know, bad shape. It's so. a good hat day. So everybody, if you have a hat and you're going to church, wear it because you're supposed to wear a hat anyway in church, right? <laughs> a bonnet. <laughs> yeah. And Easter... There are still those mothers that dress the girls up in the it's Easter fine. outfit. Yeah. But when the kids get to turn 13, forget it. <laughs> they go to church in their jeans and their ripped shirts. Yep. Yeah, we weren't allowed to do that when we were. I know. Yeah, I'm dating myself. Well, <laughs> we were the not thing allowed. that I hate the most, which I know is very, very popular, is the ripped jeans. Yeah. But they pay 75 to $100. Yeah, for the more ribs jeans. they have, the more expensive they are. Yeah. <laughs> and, you know, I think it's odd. But now, is it true? Because you guys are, you know, modern. <laughs> jean jackets are coming back? Oh, I love jean I've jackets. I've been wearing them forever. They never love went out. I love jean jackets. I had one out. years ago. Yeah, They're I, big. They're very big. I will never stop wearing my, my denim jacket. Yeah. Black, white, denim, all different colors, yeah. styles. I yeah. Well, so I love this, this color. It's really nice. <laughs> Thank yeah, you. It is. So everybody knows Casariano. I do. Our singer had an emergency, so he's not here today. Correct. But his name is Richie. Valentino, yes. Valentino. And when I met him, I'm like, this is karma. 
<laughs> and that like because I'm Valentina. Valentina. That's how I met Sal Valentinetti. Yeah. He's Valentinetti, I'm Valentina. So I meet people for odd reasons. And he's great. I was there last Thursday night. Correct. Talk about him. Let's, let's talk about so him. So Richie Valentino sings at our restaurant every Thursday from uh, 6.30 to 10. Sometimes we go to 12. Right? Yeah, no, well, some nights you can't no get on the dance floor. There's no limits that we're there going to hang out. We right. make people happy at our restaurant. Yeah, and the yeah. food. Oh. Mm. Everything. Food is, is okay. <laughs> Chef Giancarlo, and he's John very good. Giancarlo, he's gorgeous, number one. And he a comes true out. Italian boy. Yeah, and he comes out and he makes sure you like it. And he's just, it's a great place. But mm -hmm. you have, at this restaurant, you need a reservation to sit at the bar. Oh, at yes. At the bar, yes. Definitely, wow. definitely we're Can you a believe place that? where the I've called to make customers love hanging out. Yeah. Yes. And they have these. From Tuesday to Sunday. People that. It's like family. Mm -hmm. It's and like I can tell you on Thursday started with a table four. Now there's a table that comes every Thursday and they're twelve. Right, and there's that one group that I know. Yeah. They're all so nice. Right. And another gentleman that I met through Danny was Eddie Sessa, yeah. and mm -hmm. Eddie Sessa is a Sinatra singer, yeah. mm -hmm. and he sings there as well. Correct. He sings Times. once in a while now on Sundays. He yes. used to be there on Thursdays. And Bob D'Amato also sings once um, a month. Yeah, and. Uh, I went to I went on a date with Bob D'Amato no. many many years ago, and he yeah. lives in Floral Park where I grew up. Okay. And ever since I ran into him again, we've been he's been part of the club. Interesting. Wow. They threw a birthday party for me, and he, they surprised me. There's Bob D'Amato right there on the screen. Oh, there we go. He's yeah. also playing with that Ray. That place looks familiar. Yeah, he's playing with <laughs> Ray McGron uh -huh. in uh, the Bat Boy. The Bat Boy is a play about how Ray, who is a big shot, got caught by George Steinbrenner. Making stuff all over the floor. All right. <laughs> <laughs> he basically went to, he put him away and then, you know, took him out and they became wow. fast friends. So the play is going to be called The Bat Boy. Okay. And Bob D'Amato plays George Steinbrenner. Did well, you I know didn't that? know that. Yeah. It's he didn't up. share that with me. Yeah. And he does it very well. It's funny, you mentioned you, you, you were in uh, Floral Park. My mom grew up in Floral Park and she's a Polish immigrant and there was a big Polish community. And St. Hedwig's Church. That's where I went mm -hmm. to school. Yeah. Well, my mom got married there. My mom so got, did I. My mom and I got married there. <laughs> Small <laughs> but I, I hear all kinds of stories. What street did she live on? She lived on McKee Street. Oh, gosh. <laughs> right down the Court yeah. Chevrolet. Okay. Where Court Chevrolet was. Yeah, yeah. There was Cherry Lane, right? McKee Street. So they lived on McKee Street. That's did she live near the gay bar? I don't know. If there was, now it's a church. I don't know. But years ago, years ago, I don't, years know. Ago, <laughs> years ago, I don't know. It was, and it was, you know, back then. Right. It was a thing. It, it was. No, they didn't want it there. No, but can you? I don't know that anything about that. <laughs> can you know about the gay bar? No, I was a little girl when I was It's now there. a church, guys, okay? Okay. All right. But, well, you know, now it would be no problem if, if a gay bar was on the block, you know. But years mm -hmm. ago, yeah. did she go to Ollie's? Ollie's Deli was on the corner of McKee. I remember I remember that, and I, there used to be an A&P down the street. Yeah, where Mrs. Which, uh, uh, this is uh, Bro Brooks' work. My favorite thing, they used to give out those green stamps. We had books yes. and books of green oh, stamps. Oh, wow. Talk about a small <laughs> so world. I'm telling you. See, I'm dating yeah. myself Floral again. Floral Park. Is, <laughs> did you grow up there? No, I grew up in Huntington. Oh, well, Floral Station, Park's yeah. a great place to live. Yeah. I visited my grandma a lot there, though. Yeah. So. I was there for 40 years, uh -huh. and then, then we bought a house in West Hempstead. I was there for 27, mm -hmm. and now I'm in a nice little tiny co-op in North Valley Stream. And there nice. you go. The best mm -hmm. thing I did was yeah. get rid of my house. Because I got no more crap. Yeah. No yeah. more crap. It's a lot of work. It is. It's a lot so of work. what's happening? At, you know, what's your, you know, I know you have Easter's coming up. Correct. Um, we're going to be having a family meal. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're offering some uh, uh, discounts on our catering. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're going to be serving yeah. um, Easter uh, from 12 to 8. So all day? All day. So we, like, we're going to be doing some seatings from uh, 12 to 4, 6, and 8. Mm -hmm. And we're hoping to have a really successful oh, day. Oh, you will. Yeah. Always. And then you have a takeout, a big um, deal with the takeout. Yes, correct. So we're going to be that. giving a uh, okay. discount for anyone who wants to purchase a half trade or full trade. And it could be available also on our website, uh, 
Casariano New York dot com. Yes. And it could be delivered to you, so which is huge. You oh, they deli you're delivering to yep. now? Yeah, they're not going. They don't need to even come and pick it up. It Big plus. To How far will you go? <laughs> I, I think it, it has a, a limit. It's not done by us. It's by a third party. So darn it. But That's, I'm sure I'm it's. Um, I'm sure it's maybe three, four, four miles. Cook. Yeah, well. But you're more than welcome to come and pick it up. Oh, well, that's, yeah. And not and only come that. pick it up early. We'll give you extra sauce. You can warm it up. Okay. Yeah. And let me tell that. you, there is not one thing I've ever tasted there that wasn't good. Yeah. They even make the, She's uh, never complained. They make that uh, with, the, with, the, with the zucchini. What are those things? The zucchini flowers. Yeah. Did you ever eat zucchini oh, flowers? Oh, amazing. Stuffed zucchini flowers. Stuffed zucchini flowers. Zucchini yep. flowers. Yes. Stuff some mozzarella. Oh, I, and, very good. Um, I might be Polish, but I know Italian food. <laughs> he puts a twist, so he puts on his uh, uh, marinara sauce uh, anchovies. Which nice. is different, right? So that I wouldn't like. I don't it a, need anchovies. I like it. I love, Again, love anchovies. But, you know, and it's I don't just, like uh, you. You guys have the, <laughs> look, the um, what is it? The, the, what, the rice that, bowls. Yeah, the rice so bowls. So arancinis are delicious. Yeah. People come and give Maybe traits of that, especially know, in reality. Right? <laughs> so many different things, and the the shrimp is delicious, yeah. and the soup. Mm -hmm. the she soup. loves her minestrone soup. Yeah, I, I, well, I eat a lot of soup because I have, I I'm telling all the performers I have what they have. I talk too much, so I have a throat thing. Yeah. <laughs> they have it because they sing. Right, right. So right. they said it's the same difference. If you use your vocal cords a lot, yeah, and I do because it's show. Is that why I like soup too? Yeah, because yes, I talk so. too much. Yeah, and also I try to, you know, recruit people all the time, yeah. and then I do my book. <laughs> That's why I have to talk for the book, mm -hmm. and I, mm -hmm. so I do a lot of talking. <laughs> <laughs> I'm realizing that a part of my history with my medical condition is from talking too much. Yeah. And I'm learning more. Can you believe this? But without you talking, you won't be anyone. No, mm -hmm. well, that's true. Hey. That's what keeps you. Remember, 17 years ago, we all got thrown out of the Sweet Hollow Diner because we were 50, intelligent, and got fired. But wow. we used to hang out there. Mm -hmm. And the guy threw us out. That was the day we became the Breakfast Club. Why did, so why did he throw you out? Because we spent uh, three hours oh. and not enough money. But it was empty. And that, that's was, ridiculous. that was the day <laughs> the Tusha Kitchen from Newsday put us on the map because we called Newsday. We said yeah. we just got to run out of a diner. And we're <laughs> wow. professionals. Yeah. And 17 years later, we've done so many things to grow it to this. And now we're going to be in movies. Yeah. So, yeah, we're really having a lot of fun. We really are. Okay. So, um, anyway, but Danny has a beautiful family. Correct. Two sons, right? Two beautiful sons. Always James and Anthony and, and a beautiful wife. They love snacks, and uh, I, I always <laughs> I bring like them. Snacks. I like snacks. I always bring them a little baggie. Well, she when does. I, she always brings like just them the cookies. <laughs> yeah, because they like yeah. snacks, and when when his wife is gorgeous. <laughs> snacks are cool. So you, no, when so. they come in the restaurant, they're just so cute. But they're so well behaved. Mm. I don't know how you manage that. Thanks to my wife. Yeah, because today little boys are tough. Yeah, <laughs> they get into a lot of trouble. It's okay. They're so boys. now are you done? With yeah, kids? and done with kids. You're done with kids. And didn't you have a restaurant in Florida? So there are two locations in Florida uh, that are our partners. So they have so one in Ben on uh, uh, Luca Cassiani and Antonio Pariano. Oh. That's what Casariano means, the two last names okay. together. Mm -hmm. So they started the first location. Giancarlo and I have the second location, and they own the third location. And you have a third private uh, owner, right? No. Oh, I thought a, you had a third guy I never met. No, so it's so, uh, four guys, Giancarlo, Danny, <laughs> Luca, and Antonio. Oh, I didn't know that. No. I thought there was three of you. No. So that's a rumor. That's a rumor. <laughs> There's only four guys. So it's just there. Yeah. Okay. Well, mm -hmm. that's good. Danny is kind because he lets me give out my cards to everybody at the oh, restaurant. Absolutely. And um, everybody loves getting them, and it causes a conversation, and that's how I met a lot of great people. And... Um, you know, it is what it is. It just, uh, it's what goes on. So let's see. We got, um, yeah, this is from sitting in my house. I never gave it to you. Oh, thank you. And these are for you guys, one each. Well, can I thank open this now? Yeah, you can. So um, what else do you have coming Aww. up after Easter? You know, just Aww. pretty much, you know, looking forward to awesome. our season for parties. Is we're going to start Thanks. booking parties for baby showers. Yeah, a lot of weddings. You know, weddings, right. uh, christenings. <laughs> Uh, communion season is going to be coming up. Well, We're pretty much full. We still have some availability in. What about that room? Talk about that room with the glass doors, the glass room. I so love that So we room. have a little room that we call, I call it the COVID freak room now. Because of COVID, everyone oh, wanted oh, to sit COVID there. Oh, a COVID room. Okay. So, <laughs> and um, it can sit 10 guests. 
and we book it up pretty much every day. You know, people look it's forward a nice to sitting room. there. You want to be just with your family. You want to have a, yeah. a business meeting, or you just want to have a private uh, dinner with your family. Right, it's a, really it's very, a very, nice, uh, very nice, nice place where you can close the door and right. mm -hmm. no one bothers you. Mm -hmm. That's great. Very good. So. so how about some wine, guys? We just yes. poured the wine and some snacks. I'm yeah, you guys like wine. I throw yeah. I'll have one. Oh, I'll have one of these. <laughs> yes. Oh, I love Why those. Not? We gotta eat. Nothing like these. There you go. We you. serve them with our gelatos. So, salute. Oh, cheers. Happy nice Easter to everyone. Yeah. Happy, Happy Easter. Easter. Happy and Danny, Easter. you know. Thank you. I Thank you for you. all you do for the community. The people that come in there are so Thank nice. You. I think I think there was only one man that never talked to me there. Now he's my friend. But Ooh. my goal was, no, he's a doll. He's the one that just had a birthday last week. Mike. Oh, Mike. Look with the glasses. Yes. Very quiet. Correct. And he would never talk to me. He would never say hello. Tommy, and you mean? Tommy. And I the said, he will one day. It's goal. A goal mm -hmm. of mine is that he's going to talk to me. Yeah. And one day he finally did. And now he's like so friendly. And, no, uh, Tommy is. He just had a birthday last week. Yep. He turned 82. Yeah. He hasn't been a customer of the room. Our restaurant nine years, and every restaurant has been there for 35 years. And he goes to our restaurant from Thursday to Sunday, and we respect his seat at the bar, B12. He, yeah, he oh, wow. yeah, I he know is. who you're talking about. Yep. He's he, always in the same spot. Yep, and yep. you know, he no. walks in. If someone is sitting there, we bite. We sorry. do ask, I'm sorry, right. can you, would you mind just, you know. Well, you know, it's, it's nice to have that. I want to have my name. Please. Somewhere one day. <laughs> you know, that's something, believe it or not. <laughs> Um, we, we were talking with Giancarlo and having, you know, certain tables, you know, how you walk into a restaurant and it has the plaque. Yeah. yeah. There's certain customers, they table 11, they table love 15. it. Yeah. And, and it's about that. It's a place where it you is. have to walk in and feel like home. Right. Well, it's like and next door. That. There's a pizzeria down the corner. Did you go I, in? So I called Valentina. I got here early and, and I'm like, where are you? I'm like, I thought the show was canceled or something. No, for And she's like, no, you need to go next door. And go I to see Dominic. <laughs> so you met Dominic? Oh, yeah. He's a doll. He makes great soup. Oh, yeah. Leonardo's, they're on the corner. He's, nice making a, he's making a pizza in my name. That's Aww. so nice. Yeah, he's going to call the Valentina. Well, I was sitting there. I heard from two or three guests that they're known That's for cute. their soups. Yes. Yeah. His, so. Supposedly, I, I have had the soup, but I have the pizza. But whenever people come early, we wind up over there. Yeah. But I didn't want to get my hair wet, so I stayed in the car. Sure. And then... I saw you when my I did. pizzeria. Valentina asked, I did. So, <laughs> and so let's see, we talked about the room. We talked yeah. about your cooks and all the different things. Oh, the DJs, like the nights oh, correct. Have so, the dancing. Yeah. So we do a lot of different things, you know, Thursdays the music, uh, Fridays we have a DJ now from um, 9.30 to 2 in the morning. So now those, those are hot nights, so right? So we, we went from zero to 100. Um, Actually, the newspaper reached out the other day because they wanted to do an article about that. Good. How Long Island has no nightlife and restaurants like no. us. Right. Right. Saying that. Right. Like no restaurants like life. us have reinvented ourselves. Um, That's great. Yeah, and, and, and do it in a safe way. And yeah. Who called you? The girl from Feed Me? Uh, no, someone else. Oh, okay. I forgot the gentleman's name. Okay. And well, that's good. Do it. Did they call you back? Yeah. Good. Yeah, yeah. So that it's just about that, you know. The best way to... Yeah. And then on Sundays, we also have live music. It, changes uh it's more like for the a rotation no right. it's a rotation it's just the dinner music and we put it out on our social media and yeah. uh, and bob yeah. d'amato he does the 50s yeah and the, it, the it bobby changes, darren you know, we have uh -huh. a couple of different singers yeah, Lisa, yeah. uh bob we have um Lo uh, laura and bill yeah Oh yeah, Laura and Schaefer. Yes, she she's politician. the politician. Mm -hmm. She you know, she quit. Yes. She's quitting she, this year. She retired. Yeah, yeah she retired her. this year. But she's a great singer. Yep. Um, and if you ever need new ones, you know we know the ones. Listen, so. on, we have on a few. Sunday I want a rotation, so I'm always open. Yeah, to, that's good. To yeah. anyone who wants to come in and sing. So when's Bob back again? Uh, he next he's month? actually out for the month of uh, May. He's going to he's going away to, on a to cruise, Italy, yeah, and yeah. then he'll be back in uh, June. I don't have a June day yet. Yeah, well, Bob uh, goes way back to, you know, Floral Park. Yeah. Wait, you're dating him. No, I did. <laughs> One day. That was it. One day. Day. I was, I was 17. His wife is going to kill me. No, she's a dog. I'm just kidding. His wife was the, um, talk about Floral Park. She gave tickets to everyone. The Mita Maid. Oh, gosh. Oh, my and gosh. And everyone she's says, a... to the, you look familiar. I'm like, well, she was the Mita Maid. Ah. She's the lady that gave you all the tickets for 10 years, you know. Awesome. Very nice lady, though. Very, very, very like nice. lady, huh? Yeah, and they bring a crowd when they come. Oh, no, they yeah. do. Absolutely. Bob. Um, Breakfast Club loves them. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, Eddie, you know, we, we try to, ro you know, rotate because they're all over. Everyone's all over now. Oh, yeah? 
But uh, like you said, Eddie's always welcome there. You know? Oh, no, Eddie, once in a while, he fills in on Sundays. Now, yeah, also too. I know. So um, what's what's next? You have now you have the disco, you have the dancing. Just keep the keep food. doing keep doing the right thing. Right. You know, keeping our customers happy and right. You know, show appreciation in the neighborhood. They and really what about the summer? You should see what he does in the summer. Oh, we're ready. I can't wait to oh. set up outside. Outside. outside? If oh, it wasn't fun. for our outdoor seating, and we would never been back in business after right. COVID. Yeah. We had 22 t tables that we set up and. Uh, am I going to set up 20 tables now? No, but we do have an outdoor seating. But there. now, you, in the summer, you have in and out. Yeah, we bring the entertainment outside so people could enjoy the yeah. both sides. And it's and really, that's really when I started coming there, when it started oh, yeah. a long time ago outside. Yeah. yeah, we put our singer out there. Yeah. We were listening, me and Giancarlo. Um, we were at the restaurant one day. COVID was going on, we were doing some paperwork. And we heard a song by Frank Sinatra. And I said, Giancarlo, why don't we bring Eddie outside? Right. And the police and showed up and says, oh, what are you yeah. doing, Danny? I said, we're uh, allowed to uh, have food sing? to go yeah. Yeah. and drinks to go. So people started tailgating in front of the restaurant. Mm -hmm. And oh, it turned funny. into a, a night, yeah. a a night, a, you know, <laughs> wow. a night every yeah. Thursday. And people yeah. you got looked forward doo -doo. to and they came and enjoyed the music. That and was the best thing great. you did. Brought their own chairs and ate from their trucks. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. And yeah, well, it did. It has a good dedication. History. Yeah. Good history. So how many years are you there now? We're going to be going in um, nine anniversary August third. Okay. You have happy hour? I yes, we do. We yeah. offer a happy, happy hour from yeah. Tuesday to, to Friday okay. and Sunday all day. Right. All, all day? day? Happy hour? Yeah. Oh. So and they have good lunch, too. Yeah. Yeah. You come yeah. in from 2 to 9 and sit down and don't leave the bar. Are you on the southeast it's, corner? Of it's a great of bar, too. Correct. Okay, got it. Yeah. Yep. Right underneath bar. the overpass of the highway. Yep. And you could exactly. go get your lottery next door right away. They have a liquor <laughs> store, they have Chinese, the liquor they store. have a supermarket, you can get your groceries. And the fresh vegetables, yep. No, they, they, um, they're it's great, a good, great It's places. a good corner. It's a great uh, shopping center to be. Yeah. We're lucky because no one has made it there for more than two, three years. Yeah, We've no. been in business now nine. Yeah, that's great. So that's great. So, so what are you going to do for the anniversary? Uh, I don't think nine years. No. We'll we do something ten, under ten years. We did something under the fifth anniversary. Yeah. And then we do something next year. That's good. Yeah, that's a good we'll, idea. We'll be back next year yeah. in the Breakfast mm -hmm. Club. And oh, definitely. Are you kidding? We love we'll having We'll come it. up and do something. Yeah, Sal Valentinetti used to sing there. Correct. When, when we he open, was small. When, <laughs> smaller. When we opened, um, that was the first or second year that he got into the show. Yep. And obviously he gave us a lot of notice to the restaurant. And for him, and hopefully in the future he could be... Yeah, you know, I've been trying to get him for uh, nine months now. Oh, I saw him at your event. Yeah, and he was great, but he was he was very reserved. Yeah, not like I usually know him. But I have someone trying to get in touch with him for me now. I'm doing it a different way. Yeah, you know, you need your godfather to get to him. Now. <laughs> I guess get to him. Yeah. <laughs> so so tell people where to look, how to make reservations. What's your website? All that. So our website is uh, casarianonewyork.com. Uh, we use Open Table for our reservations. Yeah, now what is that? Because I don't play with that. So Open Table is where you could just <laughs> oh download an app and you could enter you know the restaurants where you want to eat, yeah. and you don't have to make a phone call. It's yeah. free. Well, we don't have to make a phone call. The we restaurants just walk in. <laughs> the restaurants we pay for a concierge service, and, but we don't have to have a hostess. That's right. It's a virtual right. hostess service, right. which is great. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> There's many ways where we you could do it. You just go through Google, or you walk in like me, I like or you call. <laughs> I we we love people, so we like people to give mm -hmm. us. A call. He always gets us going. I like yeah. calling. Yeah, not I'm me. A, I'm a phone. Person. I just go. Listen, yeah. I learned that after COVID that if you call the restaurant um, and we're not there, he yeah. goes to myself. So. Exactly, and you do pick up everything, and you yeah. do read your yes. texts. So I have to say, so, he does. You know. uh, I still like people. Yeah, and you got a nice <laughs> group of. Retired cops are coming there. Oh yeah, retired other kind of Italians are coming there. Mm -hmm. All kinds of people. <laughs> <laughs> but no matter when I go there, I meet somebody new, and uh, something no. happens. It's a it's a place where it's a family place. Yeah. So you walk in in there, and it, you wouldn't it wouldn't be a one time place that you're there. Yeah. You're gonna come back. Definitely. For dinner, you're gonna come back with your family, or one day you're gonna find your, a day that you just don't want to. Meet anybody, or yeah. and you, you can go and sit, sit in a bar, and I sat you end up by myself I, one night, and I you will make um, mm -hmm. friends for life. Yeah. The bar is friendly if you get if you get the chance to sit there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but like I said, we take reservations on open table over the phone, and we respect them when people call. Mm -hmm. 
you know, yeah. before the phone rang and it's one of my customers calling. Of that course. Mr. Wayne wants his uh, seats five and six. Right? Okay. <laughs> and we know what they like and we respect them. So. Yeah. Well, that's really good. And remember when you had that girl there that worked there that had the baby? She was no longer there. Yes. But she was her name. Michelle. Melissa. Melissa. The she breakfast club. You know, we gave her a crib. Yeah. Yeah. We oh delivered it to her house. Oh, that was so nice. It was brand new, and somebody said, "What are we gonna do with this crib?" I'm like, "I know a girl," yeah. and she took she it. Knows, she knows. She does so now happy. like balloons and the court. Yeah, stuff. I know, but she's a beautiful girl. Yep. We got friendly with her. Oh, yeah. yeah, and she uh, she loved the crib. Oh, no, I know. No. She always comes back and does she? You know, yeah. Baby, I just sent her a text. Baby's like two or three years old. It's like a little family. I'm surprised she didn't have another one yet. No. I think <laughs> well, she's okay his with restaurant. One. They're all friendly. All of them, every single one. Employees, our customers, you know. Very nice. Yeah, and I see you're doing a lot of videos. Yes. And the girls behind the bar playing all the yeah, things. Yeah, we, good. Good. we have a great staff. And yeah, it's grown a lot. These days you have to, unfortunately, be part of that whole scene of uh, the internet. Yeah, you have I'm to. not a big fan, but yeah. unfortunately you And if you don't, you need it, you're, you're making a mistake. Yeah. Yeah. Correct. So the money that you have to spend on the social media, oh, yeah. do it when you have a business. Unfortunately, it's part of it. You yeah. either do it the hard way, like I do it, you know, your kids, or you do it the right way with a company. Correct. We have a company that yeah, manages Yeah, and they're for doing us. a great job for you. Yeah. But, you know, either way, you need it. That's it. I, I hire kids that are in college that want credit. Oh, that's, that's good, too. That's and what that's I good. do. You know, that's good too. it doesn't cost yeah. me anything. You know. <clears throat> but, uh, and then I have a great, great lady, Therese. She's sitting in our audience. She does <laughs> all of our beautiful, colorful artwork and, oh, that, and logos. It's not and, easy. No, but I she's tried great. doing it, and it's just yeah. it's, no. She it's knows how to do it. someone or having someone that yeah. knows what they're doing because well, you're gonna make a mistake. She's with me three years already. Went fast, yeah. And now she lives close to here, so she visits me more because we used wow. to be in West Hampstead. Mm -hmm. Correct. And we're only here since January. Correct. And so I'm lucky because she's down the block. So well, Danny, we really Thank appreciate you. you coming. Thank you for having me. I have me. some I goodies it. for the kids here because you know they always get goodies. Can I have this that, one? Honey? Sure. Here you go. We got two. Yeah. Oh my God! One of them writes, right? Yeah. No, this. this they both write already, but James no, is a bigger. No, this one's not for him. Wait, <laughs> Therese, there's another one in there. Just give Danny one on the way. Oh, out. they're gonna love this. Okay, and this is for you. I don't know if they're gonna make it on the um on the way to to the restaurant. I'm doing these little perfume things because I think they're so nice to give yeah, ladies. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Shit. Thank you. So you tell the kids it's from the crazy lady from the restaurant. Oh, please, they love you. <laughs> And your wife is beautiful. Thank you. I wanted to just put one little shot of her in there because she's so beautiful. Thank so you. So I left it in the other one. Oh, I appreciate it. So we'll see you soon. Yes. Thank you for coming. And yes. everybody, go to Casariano. Thank you. Oh, and here comes our other guest. So let's great. Yeah. <laughs> so thank you, Danny. Thank you. Appreciate Take it. Yeah. Really Ladies, great. Thank you so you. much. See you soon. Look okay. to Take care. You, okay? uh, Anthony on the way out. Okay? Yes, I will. Bonnie, come on down okay. for a second. Here comes Anthony. Anthony. Hey, Anthony. Yeah. Now we already introduced Bonnie, but we're going to introduce her again. This is you told you. me you were going to take your pants it. off. What happened? I changed my mind. <laughs> 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 I she didn't have pantyhose. <laughs> And a woman of my age needs pantyhose. Well, she said to me, this is a dress. I'm like, it is? It, it is. So she goes, I might take my pants off. I said, okay, we'll take your pants off. It's fine with me. I went in the bathroom Thank you, and I looked so at myself. Nice. They, they have a, lot, a big mirror with good lighting. And I was like, no, that, I changed my mind. So but he's, you convinced me to go to his restaurant. <coughs> oh, yeah. Sure. Oh, for sure. And you make sure you tell me yes. why. Yes, absolutely. So quickly, because I know we have another guest that just yes. walked in who took a probably a two-hour drive to get here. <laughs> no, I don't want that far. No, Anthony oh, oh. did. Poor <laughs> Anthony. Anthony. Oh. He's a great guy. Okay. <laughs> and um, so let's talk about your show, your okay. what you do with Governors, My okay. Old Stomping Grounds. Yes, I start, that's how I met Valentina, as we both had a radio show at Goes Radio. Uh, I am a, a comedian, and I, I just had my birthday two, about two weeks, a little after two weeks ago, and I performed on the main stage at Governor's. Which is a big deal. Uh, mm -hmm. For a comedian, that's a big deal. And they call me, uh, and I've, I've done McGuire's and Brokerage. You start with bringer shows, and you continue to do bringer shows, but most comics don't get to the point where they call you and you just perform, you don't have to bring people. So uh, I made it as she far as graduated. my goal. I, I made it past my goal. My goal was uh, I, I had two like s certain comedians I wanted to perform with uh, professionally. One is Joe DeVito. He's my favorite comedian. 
and uh, he's on the Greg Gutfeld show. He, he's a writer. Yeah. Oh, um, I got to meet him. Oh, yeah. So he was my, my comedy teacher, and I, my goal was to be in a professional show with Joe, and I, was, I performed with him at McGuire's, so that was done. And then, you know, to get on the main stage, I've ha been on the main stage m more than a bunch of times. And there are some comedians who will never make it to the main stage. That is a big so deal. Christopher Brian Roach, uh, on my birthday, he was the headliner. I don't know, if, you know, you know. And who she that had is. a huge birthday party for herself last year. Actually, it was two years ago. Was it? Was, yeah, it was my it was, it was my sixtieth birthday. Look uh, at her. Party. She looks great. So yeah. I'm six. I'm sixty. I was sixty two a couple two, on March fourteenth, and I had a. Uh, it was a. Huge. It was really like a divorce, freedom party. <laughs> Plus, it was my 60th birthday, so I rolled it all in one, and I had a huge party at the huge. Crest Hollow. Yes. Yeah. It was like a it wedding. It was a wedding. It was like a wedding, and all, a lot of people who didn't know other people, but a lot of them were like, I'm friends with people from the band Street Fighter, so the mm -hmm. two lead singers were there, all these comedians were there, John Ziegler, who's very popular. Oh, I like um, him a lot. Yeah, he was, a, like, all these people that... I had my own family who doesn't know who anybody is. The funny part is about being a comedian is that everybody seems very interested at first, but then the only people that really care about what you do are other comedians. Yeah. And they really only care because they want to like see how they're doing compared right. to how you're doing. Not because they're happy. Well, there's a lot of competition. Not all of them. Not all of them. It's, but it's the business. Yeah. It's Unfortunately, there's a lot of competition it's in this world. It's a cutthroat business, yes. very. Well, this is yeah, true. And, and I don't have that nature. I'm no, like more, not at all. Uh, You're so, sweet. So I'm. I get a lot of um, into situations that I'm just shocked by. I was a teacher first yes. for 32 years, a kindergarten teacher. So mm -hmm. the this compared to what I did is like night and day. Yeah, because you weren't yeah. allowed to even curse at school. It's and true. now you say all kinds of things <laughs> now on you your show. Yes, now, the, now you're encouraged to curse. No, I'm just kidding. But, and um, wear these dresses that you couldn't take your pants off. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I'm known for, I usually wear a little black dress with pantyhose and black heels. And that's, that's what that's I'm That's what known she's for. known for. Yeah, that's, my, black that's dress. my look. So you need and, the, and the funny part, it was yeah. raining outside, so this is the one day I decided not to dress, you know, and I had to bring my son with me. We, we, yes, you know, which so is another story. An, another story. She's an advocate for, you told Yes, I'm an advocate me. for, uh, I'm an autism awareness advocate. Um, my whole family has autism running, like my niece is autistic. My brother was autistic back when nobody knew what that was. Then I had kids, two of my sons are autistic. And so um, I have a social media following on Facebook, just my name, Bonnie Scalisi, and a lot of times I just post photos of, you know, situations with my boys. Yes, you or, do, but or, you do yes. quite a bit And then I boys. tag uh, all the awareness She's things. Got a lot of patience, this girl. I, I, <laughs> I have a lot, I got a lot of the jokes from that, too. Well, <laughs> it's like, true. If you tell the truth, it's very funny. And it's it's very interesting. <laughs> one, of my, one of the, one of the, it, it's, it's funny and tragic at the same time, but yes. the, the key with comedy is to try to turn tragedy into comedy. Mm -hmm. But a lot of times after a show, I'll have people come up to me and say, you know, I have an autistic cousin. Something in I, common, you know, right. And, and, you know, thank you for saying those things because you, everybody thinks thinks these things, but they don't say them out loud. Well, it's more it, talked it, about now than it was years ago. Oh, please. When when my mother was, was raising my brother, no one knew what autism was. Right. And... Uh, they only knew from Rain Man. When Rain Man came that out, was a great movie. again, I'm dating myself with Rain Man, <laughs> with Dustin Hoffman. Uh, that's what people thought autism was, which is Dustin Hoffman was like at the top level of what autism. I mean, now they, they've taken the autism spectrum and they've added, um, I forgot what the other thing is called, but it's when you have a social issue and they blended them well, together. But yeah, um, they have a lot he of was programs a, a savant. Us. Yeah, he was a savant. Yeah, and mm -hmm. that's very rare. Mm -hmm. So people, when they were like, "Oh, autism," back then, mm -hmm. they just assumed like you could count matches with ball on the floor, and you knew exactly how many you you know were there, and all kinds of things. But autism has such a range, and it there does. there are, are ones who like Dustin Hoffman could speak in full sentences, and then there are people who can't talk yeah. at all. Yeah. There are people so. that are self-injurious, like my niece is self-injurious. And yeah. like, it can, it runs the gamut. And um, the best thing that you can do for a family 
um, when you see there, ha they have someone with autism, it's just not to stare. <laughs> Right. I mean, you know, make make people Just feel right, like right. like part of the group. And and I, as a parent, I always was like, just the way you would do with a little kid, like just to be aware as a parent, like giving advice, go to the place ahead of time. And if it's not really for your child, then not, and even that goes for a typical child. Like you wouldn't bring a typical child to like a very, very fancy restaurant if he's, the type that's going to run around and distract everybody. Right. It's just, then people are going to stare at you, you're not going to have a good time, the other people are not going to right. have a good time. So it's like, you use common sense. Right. You use common well, sense. Well, you explained that good. And was very proud of what you did with your son. Thank letting you. him move into a home. He was here earlier. It was so funny. You she had actually incense. let go of her son. He lives and live with her anymore. And he's doing mm -hmm. fabulous. Well, I have two of them. So the older one, um, fabulous. He's he's he, he, he just turned 30. I got him into a group home. And it's very difficult to get your in. kids into the oh group yeah home. you gotta so, know somebody who will yes have money y yes so <laughs> I, I i and he's doing great there so i have the, the other the younger one with me who's a twin is a twin sister and she's a speech pathologist so she works with handicapped kids and um so Brandon, I had here earlier, and you had the incense burning, yeah. and I had him sit there, and he was like sitting there, oh. <laughs> like really enjoying that incense. Oh, you like my new toy? So we're gonna let you step down because oh, sure. we had our this big sponsor in today, Anthony. Thank you. This is for thank you. Thank you for having me, and um, also thank you for everything you do with the seniors. Here, I I know you like to plant, so this is for you today, and there's oh, some jelly beans. Oh, thank in there. you, thank you, Valentine. And these for are all yours, me. Bonnie. Oh, all right. Thank, Thank you, everybody. Bye. Hang out. Don't leave. Nice Anthony, you. it's Prince Spaghetti Day. Yeah. Ah. Right. How are you, my That's friend? A little story about the Prince Spaghetti Day deal. Yeah, the I can't believe it. The guy who owned that company was actually, his name was Anthony Pellegrino. Get, get out. I swear. I really? <laughs> Thank really. you for coming. You want to get out already? Right? You look nice. Hi, Tanya. Hi, baby. How are you, how are you, how you doing? Mwah. I won't reach, but how are you? Hi, baby. How are you doing, sweetheart? Lydia. Hi, honey. How are you? Good. Thanks so much for coming. I'll be silly. I've never seen you in brown. I've oh, seen you in good. many you colors, but never in brown. Yeah, I like it. Funny. I was going to be a cowboy today, brown? but I didn't decide yeah. not to do yeah, it. You need to so really match yeah, really yeah. well Thank today. You. Very Thank nice. You. So before we start talking about uh, everything you have to talk about, let's talk about Lydia. Us. Oh, us. First oh, Lydia. Like, I like the well, Robert Palmer are you guys, girls today. <laughs> are you together or what? I mean, <laughs> we are you know, buddies. like we do a lot. Yeah, okay. So you're best friends. We are best friends. Besties, they call it. Right? Yes, yes, that's the thing. So then let's talk together, the two of you. Go ahead, Tonya. You got well, the, we, let's talk about Power Magazine. <laughs> Let, let's talk. Yeah. Well, we yes. have so many things to talk about. This, it doesn't get better than this. We're Anthony. concise, though. Yeah. Well, show them, but power. go ahead, talk. Power. Well, power. power. Look at this. Uh, we got the power. <laughs> That's beautiful. Isn't wow. Well, yeah, that? it's all so awesome. Yeah. Yes. I can't believe it. His uh -huh. Ellen's been this in Power Magazine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Absolutely, Lydia's yeah. been in Power Magazine. Valentina's yeah. been in Power Magazine. Biggest thrill of my life. Really. Power stands for Professional Organization of Women of Excellence Recognized. So we're a women's organization. We help women with networking, exposure, recognition, as well as a quarterly magazine where we list celebrities, icons, everyday hardworking women. And um, it's just a great organization. As you want. Wonderful, wonderful women. And Hard -working, you powerful that does women. so much helping women grow. And, uh, it's amazing what you what you did for me. I mean, just thank you, just thank being you. around the people that you know. Yes, and yes. We do a travel club now. We've been to Nashville. We were twenty three women. It was great. God, we, all, was we all got along. <laughs> that was wow, fun. that had to be <laughs> some trip. Yes, <laughs> we're doing another one in October in Fort Lauderdale, I believe. I don't know if I could say it yet, but I believe with Captain Sandy. Mm -hmm. Um. So that's going to be a lot of fun. Really? And uh, yeah, and the event. And my gala. That's every yeah, year. Yeah. Mm -hmm. that was well, every other year. I do it, it every other so year. It was so overwhelming. Oh, my but God. But it's, it's a lot of work. Yeah, I know, yeah. and you yeah. found the cupcakes in the end. I found the cup. Oh my! Don't, <laughs> they don't never say put that. The don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Nobody's you, say, you know, let me say this. <laughs> Tonya is so humble. So I've known Tonya for I don't even know. It seems like forever, but not even yeah, that long. No, no, but no, no. nonetheless, yeah. you have created this organization that I don't think people understand the extent of the value 
of um, what they get out of this. There is power in numbers. It's a national organization. It's not yes. just local. Right. Right. You're here, so right. obviously there's sometimes right. more going on. On Long Island, you are, and New you York are City. on the on the west coast of Florida. Mm -hmm. You are, like you said, we're all California. over international actually because you're doing trips to different countries. Italy, you Italy, went to Italy below you deck, below deck, and Captain you are Sandy. you're dealing with, you know, whether you're a celebrity because you have so many celebrities on your covers, or you're just a person, I don't mean just, but you are a, a woman working locally yeah. at whatever industry you're doing. You are taking everyone That's and you're silly. kind of giving them that platform. You're giving them that community. You're hmm. giving them the resources through, and this is just such a small part of it. You know, yeah. this is this is lovely and I love, you know, yeah, who doesn't right. like a magazine? It's really behind but it's the, the organization. What, yeah, what we do behind the scenes. And you're a people organization, yeah. unlike a lot of other, um, networking organizations mm -hmm. you actually have people that work that speak to other people yeah. on the telephone right. <laughs> because they like each other which most people don't do because that's a hard thing you know yeah in this well, business so you, if important. women like each other it's a good thing yeah, yeah. there was some that so doesn't. i i just want to say how i endorse and i i just i endorse Thank this you. organization and i strongly encourage everyone it's power wo w o e yes. dot com right yep. and uh, check something. it out and yeah. i just Thank and, you. and you didn't have to pay me for this. <laughs> no, but you can see it comes from, you know, pushing I really feel so strong. Yeah, look at you guys. I feel tan they are. They're beautiful women. I so know, they're gorgeous. gorgeous. Thank you. Absolutely. I appreciate what you said. You. And I think, you. number one, I think integrity is very important. It is. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I do what I say is. I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. And a lot of, unfortunately, a lot of companies don't. Absolutely. So that's mm -hmm. important brought up getting somebody on the phone. Everything today is email and texting. Mm -hmm. You call my office, you get a live person. Yeah, and it's nice face to face. Yeah. Yeah. You know. Um so yeah, we do we do the best that we can. Um you know, like Lydia said, it's nice to have celebrities in there and on the cover, but really it's more about the everyday hard working woman. Which, such right. as Lydia who <laughs> yes. who is who has created these dresses that we're wearing, which she'll tell you. You about. actually make these? Yeah, well yeah. I did, yeah. yes. I had them made in New York actually in New York what City. The hell? Oh it's a, yeah it's made a long in story. America. <laughs> yes, they and are. She's wow. a lawyer yeah. and she's a model and, wow. and this is really the face of, of of, of a, a power lot of woman, people, right? Well, thank you. I mean, I this is a that. power woman right here. So she's that. exactly the type of, of woman that we like to feature. Absolutely. So now let's talk about first about the first thing you did. What was that? The modeling or no? The I, I, I'm not really a model as much as she she's thinks. A model. I, well, <laughs> you look so like my, a model. My day job. I've been practicing law for 33 years. Okay. Um, I work for a law firm, Brown Altman Deleo. Right. It's a full service um, firm that deals with um, corporate clients, real estate development. And I basically run their commercial litiga litigation department. Mm -hmm. So I've been doing that, like I said, for 33 years. And I love that. That's my passion. That is my career. And they're in Bethpage? Where are they? No, they're right in, Mel right in no. Melville. Oh, Melville. Yeah, okay. at uh, mm -hmm. 538 Broad Hollow Road in Melville. And um, the partners are fantastic. Keith Brown is, is an assemblyman, actually. Um, Dave Altman is mm -hmm. just, he's been around forever. He knows everyone. We have, we have clients that, um, I don't know if I'm supposed to mention them. I won't. <laughs> That are very successful, it you want very to say successful high business profile. people, yeah. high profile. Um, we represent um, gas stations and you know a lot of a big, big, big projects. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, like the remember the old Newsday building? Yes. Um, so yes. we worked on that, converting it. Now it's Amazon. So that was mm -hmm. the firm's uh, work. That's and, terrific. Um, and Mike DeLeo, he represents or he brought in a lot of banks. So I don't want to say he because we all work together. Sure, you're so a team. that mm -hmm. is my my uh, career. But it doesn't define me. So people say, how do how do you you know lawyer and then mm -hmm. the dress thing? So this was something that just started out as, um, someone said to me, a very dear friend of mine. Do you know Fran Petito? By yes. Name? Okay, very dear friend of mine. She said, all right. So if you were to define yourself, you have a little box. Like what what do you rep like what do you, what do you want to bring with you or what defines you? I said it's the little black dress, <laughs> because I also teach a women's safety awareness seminar it's called stylish safety i'm a black belt in karate so i taught it in a little black dress with high heels on so Terrific. i said yeah and it was and and it's always a continuing story so i was in um a dress shop eva of, of saville you know everyone knows eva yes eva fapis yeah. one of our dearest friends yeah. i was in a store i was com i was going to be competing in a in a pageant because every three <coughs> years i do a competition. I've yeah. been very fortunate. I've won them. <laughs> yeah, well, but I anyway, see that so in your <laughs> She's a winner. She's Vegas. a winner. But New anyway, York look. America, top model 2022, <laughs> Corporate America 2013, yep. New York International, 
You're just you're, the greatest. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. I've had the best time. So talk yeah. about Women Power Magazine and a network of women. I have been um, part of that world, which people don't understand. It's not about, like, toddlers and tiaras where they have this ridiculous, crazy yeah, nonsense going I get on. That. Yeah. It's like-minded women who, you know, want to help each other. Usually 50% of your score is the interview. So that's where you win. You win an interview. And all the rest is kind of fun, you yeah. know? Right. But, um, but fast forward, going back to the dress, I was in Eva's fitting room, and I... I had on there with these underwear that had like these these pa like this. See these things? Check yeah. that out. Oh, what do you in these, little right? shorts. <laughs> no, that's Anthony, the butt. Anthony, that's the butt. Anthony. <laughs> yeah, Anthony. Ellen will find it. It's, it's, it's the, chi the chicken cutlet for the butt. <laughs> <laughs> it's the butt cutlet. <laughs> oh, this is for the butt. I was gonna put it in yeah. there. Yeah, no, that's that's these. So but anyway, so like, I think that's a butt. I don't do butt stuff. Wait, do I have a butt cutlet? I don't think so. Oh, no, I have And these are the boot. Look, those are the boot. This is the boot one. one. <laughs> that's anyway. what I'm, yeah, I don't so need that either. I but tried on those things. This I, and I couldn't put it in the butt. <laughs> I have the but big the, butt. So there's a whole, i got to tell you, you don't have to because in this dress. So anyway, let me Every just say, on, I yeah. tried on this dress and I had the, the butt pads in, but my bra straps were showing and I'm like, why can't there be an outfit that has everything built into it? And I'm like, aha moment. And yeah. I created okay. a dress that has a built-in shapewear. It has a built-in bra and it has like little cups, uh, pockets rather. You put these in, which I mean, I feel, this is quality. <laughs> feel yeah, and no, these, I feel. if yeah. you... Yeah. you have and you, know, you don't have to put them in, but if you want to, you, there's little pockets back yeah. here, so you have little little tushy pads. That because, is great. Because it's all about the butt now. Yeah. Well, well, I, I know. Fill them yeah. all up with stuff. The butt Kim <laughs> Kardashian butt, right? Yeah. yeah. No, but the butt is big right now. People it is. get no pun intended. Yeah. <laughs> they the get yeah. shots for their butts now. Yes, the Brazilian butt lift, yeah. right? They take it from oh here and they inject your butt. <laughs> anyway, so long and short of it is, I got a utility patent on the dress. I had them all made in New York City, right in the, wow. the fashion district. Congratulations. Um, yeah, and, and right now I'm at that point where um, sculptura.couture. That's com. a new company. So that's the website. So I also have so I have these dresses. That's one division, yes. and then I also have a bunch of other stuff. So what else do you have? I, I dressy dresses, work dresses. I have. Oh my god! Everything. I got the most Jumpsuits. beautiful white dress. You wore with on, fringes, yeah. I wore below it on deck. below deck on the show. I mean, everybody was calling when they saw, where'd you get that? Where'd you get that? <laughs> Sculptura Couture. So now so, how do you market your clothes and all that? So I, I actually just do online, so yeah. I'm looking to partner with someone, potentially, because I'm a freaking lawyer. I don't know fashion. Oh. <laughs> yes, you and do. you know, know what? No, I'm, I'm kidding. I, I know what I know. There, <clears> there comes a point sometimes where you need help. Right. So, well, right? That's so very that's important. why there's women's organizations. That's right. why there are networking groups. That's why... I come on a show like yours just yeah. to share my story. Well, I now and I know about this dress. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you do. Yeah. yeah. So I'll be telling everyone about it. <laughs> yeah. I can't yeah. wear one, but I will definitely get you busy. You probably could. I, I, what sizes do you It's very stretchy. Do you have a, do you have a no. plus size? <laughs> Not yet, but Not. I was, seriously, I was, I was actually considering <laughs> that. But you're going to, with the truth be told, I started out with the first, there's five styles with, mm -hmm. with um, it's extra small through large. Because believe it or not, the fabric actually costs a lot of money. Yeah, and I, I just wanted to get the first beautiful. run. Yeah. Mm -hmm. the so the first great. run yeah. was just a number of quantities, you know, however many. But we were going to do Curvy Girl. So that was the next step. Oh. But that's when I partner with someone that wants to there launch the Curvy Girl. All right. Girl. Well, um, I used to write for Bold Magazine, which is all about big, beautiful women. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I know the publisher, so... Well, there I'll you go. connect you to uh, him. I think this is a, a, and I'll tell you, there there are women who are curvy that wear this yeah. dress, and it's it's phenomenal. And here. I have a um, one of my members, um, Geneva. She's a big, beautiful black woman, mm -hmm. and she never wore makeup till the day she joined the Breakfast Club, yeah. and now she's a <laughs> now model. She's, now wow. she's a model, and she walks the runway. Yeah, mm -hmm. she and she's a big, beautiful woman, and she's yeah. very famous doing designer. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna hook you up with her. Great, great. And so, so there um, you go. There's two that? people right yeah. there. And That's why yeah. I'm known as the ultimate connector. That's Power right. is about connecting That's people. Right. Mm -hmm. I Very wanted nice. her to be on the show. Yes, and I'm <laughs> glad she came. Because she should tell her story. So, the, again, and the website is? It's um, sculpturacouture.com. Okay. So when you yeah. have a flyer, like I tell, she came mm -hmm. with a bunch today, send them to me. I'll put it on. Sure. For my Be people great. that sponsor my show, I do yeah. that for them. Yeah. You know, it's like a... A hundred percent. What do you call that? Like, you know... Water. It's a give and take. Yeah. It's one hand washes the other. Exactly. Right. Yeah. yeah, I, I will. Can we say so, yeah. <laughs> Can we say well, no. yeah. <laughs> And I met these wonderful people. Guess how I met them years ago? 
<laughs> at Sal Valentinetti's concert. Ah, okay. Oh, and that's yeah. how that's we met a long time ago. They're recognizing now, right? Yeah. I know. And, and uh, I went to the party after because they thought it was family because my name was Valentina. Yeah. <laughs> and that's how we met you. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's awesome. Ellen and she's been my friend since, both of them. Oh, yeah. They're both wonderful. Great Ellen people. And, and, and let's talk about you too. Windows on the Lake. Wow. Yeah, thanks. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah, we got a lot of things going on. It's a big weekend this weekend. We have the Easter. Easter. Uh, Event, which is you know always like up to a thousand people. Yes, and oh, a lot of kids all weekends, yeah. dressed up, and we got the Easter Bunny running around doing all the <laughs> stuff. I love that. You know, and the little kids doing the uh, you know jelly beans and the Aww. Easter roll. And it's all a great stuff. place to Fun bring family your place grandchildren place and you for that night. But then, uh, yeah. Yeah. and then we do serious like concerts and stuff too mm -hmm. now because they're filling in between um, the weddings that we do. Um, we've really rebranded ourselves into more things. You know, weddings are a little down. People kind of like you know. When the economy's high, you know, like you know, uh, with the it costs more to live, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. weddings so, are expensive. So, now, so, then yeah. they, so they kind of like slow up on that a little bit, and they wait until it's a better time to do it, right? Mm -hmm. So, uh, we as a catering facilities, right, we need to keep every space filled as much mm -hmm. as we possibly can. And you so, have so many. So we just opportune opportunity is to with the space we're going to put something in it. So mm -hmm. whether it's a fundraiser. And a lot of these things, actually, that we do, these um, uh, murder mysteries or the, or the explosion nights for the Latin, the Latino things, or the Santana, Santana night, or the Rob Stewart mm -hmm. and Eagles night, and things like Look that. Look at all this. Yeah. <coughs> we do. Uh, we also have the Beach Club, which we do in networking nights starting in... Um, uh, Wednesdays, yeah, May twenty ninth, is going to be our grand opening over there. Yeah. For the outdoor, the we the the Wednesdays that we did last year. So those uh, are fun. I Beach think Club those. Wednesdays. So we do a lot of events with that. That's so nice we bring too. in major yeah. bands like the seventies band and all that stuff, and we have a large mm -hmm. attendance. And in that uh, the beginning part, like the five to nine, uh, five to mm -hmm. seven, we do like a a networking thing for businesses like mm -hmm. in the local area. So each one I picked, like each town. I belong to seven chambers, so being so each chamber is going to. Do you have any, any free time at all? Uh, not really. Um, <laughs> matter of fact, it's very tough. To, my kids are in from Europe, and I just found out from my son that we're actually having another grandchild. Congratulations! So, Congratulations. so this will be my fifth. Wow! So it's just crazy now. That's so to get that nice. opportunity, so then they're going upstate New York. So actually tonight, we have a live jam at my place. After that, we're going straight to upstate New York. They rented a house for the day. I'm lucky if we can stay the whole day because uh, Ellen's got a spiritual event yeah, on this Saturday. this is coming up. I'm going to go to the next one. On Saturday. It's too much And so she's weekend. got that thing going on for everybody in power and teaching yeah. themselves. Uh, and she's bringing uh, in different about, women. Uh, yeah. you know, everybody's yeah. psychic ability and their spiritual content that people want to get inside them. Absolutely, right. yeah. And to she get asked rid of me to join the next one. Yeah, you got to come. Absolutely. Yeah, we're going to yeah, be yeah, one yeah. of the speakers at the so, next one. Wow. So besides all our events and things like that, with that, and, and obviously we're blessed with Tanya and, and Lydia with all her things, we've always been invited to all their events and stuff, which we love. We go with Brad, Cause Corn, and Brad, uh, Miss Brad, Johnny, been busy, guys, yes. Whatever. So, you know, so, with all that yeah. stuff, the networking and the events that we do, we're bringing a lot, lot of uh, people together which actually helps us in keeping the places full. Of course, you know, yeah. the weddings and things like that. You know, um, we're, we've been voted uh, number one, you know, best of Long Island, of course. You know, there's a lot of things for that. We also have uh, the best that are not, the best of Long Island wedding. Yeah, the wedding the night, best, every, right? Yeah. Everything. Everything is like all those things across the board, the spot and whatever the case is. We made every single one of them across the category, which uh, we're so proud of, actually. You right should now. be. So, I mean... We work how hard. Many years, so how many years have you been We're 30 this? years. We celebrate our 30-year anniversary wow. in December. Nice. And uh, we, um, you know, we've been rocking it, thank God. You know, we yeah. had some little turmoil last year with, uh, you know, broken water pipe and this, that, whatever, at the Beach Club Estate, but yeah. actually made us rebuild it and turn it into something, another brand new thing, to bigger, beautiful room, yeah. you know, uh, and then uh, it's just, everything's been taken off from there more so than we've had before. And let's talk about the films. Yes. Now he's so, in films too. I know. I so know. we've been doing that for the past uh, four or five years. Yes. That's how we met Soho because we yeah. actually brought him in right. and, like uh, him and a bunch too. of our he's clans, nice you know, guy. got him into the movie business. Um, and then uh, when we did that, we made a couple of films, and then we actually that took one of our guys that are in the film to make another film, which me and Ellen are the lead in. Can't wait to uh, see that's it. That's the Good Samaritan. We actually had a premiere for that already, and then we had um, where last night we were in another one called Ooch. Uh, which is uh, another another film uh, uh, where we're actually the only two uh, Caucasian people. I have to say this in an African American film. Ooch, it's that's called? all about. Ooch, yeah, Ooch. Uh, Ooch. So basically, it's all about you know uh, 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 the black environment when they're in, involved in 
uh, you know, with the crime and the drugs and the this and the that. And then we're, they married into an Italian American family. Hello, that's what we are. <laughs> right? So kind like of like that, that kind of stuff. That's like a the, good the head story. of the families and stuff. Yeah. So last night we're, they're getting a grant, and we, we go in front of a film commission, and uh, we had to run there last night. And they were uh, showing our obviously our starter, you know, thing, a sizzle, wheel, sizzle, wheel, sizzle wheel, sizzle wheel to get uh, money and things like that. And they were doing a critiquing class with all the different cast and characters of hmm. not even from the film, but actually we did live interaction with the people actually doing a part in the film there in front of them. But we also, you know, showed that starter reel, and then we also took. You know recommendations and stuff from the from audience, people, right? Yeah, which is which is a novel thing for us because we never really did any of that before. Everything's always been a committee of like the five of us, you know, looking at the film. Yeah, and doing but whatever. it's, and good, it's but only our own opinion. So when you have a lot of people like pointing out things that like sometimes not obvious, mm -hmm. but it's obvious to somebody else, and yeah. it's like wow, you know. Well, did you find it? I can't helpful even believe they picked that up. You know? Was it's it like, helpful or was it a little too much? What's that? Was it helpful to hear everybody's? Oh no, it was definitely helpful. It was uh, definitely oh, a thing good, where yeah. you know where it became a. Um, constructive criticism yeah. and the constructive criticism is going to not going to take this and knock this out of the park because the other people agreed to we fix just two or three things they'll give us the money so so that's, that's another good. positive move that's so great. and uh, I'm so happy that we actually met them and stuff like that and this is because being in the film industry you know, everybody's connected somehow, right? It's like right. everybody in the music business. All of a sudden, business, now, yeah. once everybody you get in, in the one. music business is connected. Everybody in the fashion mm. business they is connected. All know each other. Everybody yeah. in the entertainment business yeah. is connected somehow. So, and the next thing you know, it's like the six degrees of no, right? Separation, so, next, right. The next thing you know, it's like, how do you even know them? It's like, oh my God, you know, you find out on Facebook, you know, that somebody's related to somebody, like a cousin yeah. or a brother. And it's like, what? I you probably know? went to mass <laughs> with your mother. Shows up. No, I'm sure I went to church with your mother in Flora Park at St. Oh, Edwards. No, no, no. How about that young? She's a lot. She's no. You're definitely younger than her. She's 84. <laughs> I'm 71. Yeah. Wow, that's she a big difference. She yeah. could have been. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's a big difference. I think. But I used to talk to all the old ladies, so you never know. I could know your mother. Maybe she babysat you. <laughs> right. Exactly. <laughs> that could exactly. Be. That could be. <laughs> so you know Bonnie. Do you know Bonnie? Bonnie Scalisi was on before you came in. Oh, uh, Bonnie, not the, the comedian. Yeah, no, she's because I, I actually probably met her. I think I met I her. Know your wife. With, yeah, yeah, with, so with you Dan, Dan Romano. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. scary. Uh -huh. That's okay. <laughs> Let's I love Dan. Go <laughs> <laughs> but you'll talk to me <laughs> when we come down, all right? When we, when we finish. Absolutely, yeah. She's great. She's in her own thing now. She does it all well, by herself. Well, she needs to be like this. You know, she's going to come up with stuff, right? We're going like, to have comedy spot. night at your place. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, actually, that's the only thing we haven't done. Oh. Because you <laughs> know why? It. It's it's it. it's something it's something that you do. That's that belongs in the comedy scene. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's something like you have that that wall you have that thing it's that audience is just different, different. Yeah. The, it's the coming for a couple of drinks and that's all they expect they don't want to eat yeah they don't want to eat they don't yeah. want to do whatever and it's not like whatever but that's what it's made for like in the right. city right and it's made to bring people up and, right. and actually practice their routines so a lot of the stuff is like new yeah right new material that they're trying it's not doing the stuff that they're doing on a regular basis because they're doing it on a regular basis they're in a big auditorium right you know on stage in the mm -hmm. madison square garden or something like that it's like it's a bash of skelco those are guys that are doing it and repeating themselves somewhat right and coming up with big acts well that's so true. you have to get somewhere you have to get these parts to get to there yeah. so now uh, i think we have right. some uh we have some slides we're gonna show awesome that uh you know we're Our commercial well, it's not your commercial, <laughs> but if you had one, I would have done it. You know, we're getting better. I'm getting better, and you see a little difference yes. from the other oh, place. Oh no, absolutely, yes. Yeah, yeah. and it's now you walk in here, and it's like you know. It's my commercial windows are like you go. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's a lot different here. We we bring, there. You go. There's your nice slide for Easter brunch. <laughs> Everybody, you gotta go. Yeah, but it looks like a, a eggs in a basket. Yeah, well, <laughs> <laughs> that's it. You know, but we have a huge buffet. There's a, a 65 foot buffet of food. Of wow, wow. <laughs> unbelievable! That's a food. lot. I'm not of just food. saying that the food is unbelievable because of me. Well, it is. Listen, I've you know, been there. I'm a test to it. So if you see, if not you see a skinny that. chef, you'd be in trouble. <laughs> the right? windows when Never the sun is shining. <laughs> chef. When the sun is shining, at windows on the that's lake. Right, that's right. And the <laughs> yeah. and the, the view of the water and oh, everything is yeah. amazing. Yeah. Yeah, well, this is it. This is that's yeah. the view that you're going to see. Yeah. Need that. Thing. See, I didn't have that. I would have put that up there. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you like my new toy? 
<laughs> so you squeeze the little nerfy thing there, whatever the case is. Try it out, guys. Does it double as like a little uh, scrubby dub in the shower? Is that what that does? Yeah. Is that what okay. that's for? I think it's a stress it's a ball. Ball. I actually yeah. thought it was kind of yeah. cute. Yeah. yeah. This, the, it's a stress the, the little stuff that's in. The men usually like it. I should give that to some of my salespeople. Is that the pull the French tickler? Yeah, maybe. Maybe we could get those two together. Yeah. So now look at this, guys. Something I never knew had. But I mean, I thought people were just getting shots in their butts. Nope. But this girl, well, okay? But, you know, well, that's this true one. Too. This guy's, listen, you need a butt, a new butt? <laughs> Pull on this lady. Get a dress. She'll put Don't get a butt dress. shot. Get a no, dress. No. And then right. you need the boobs? She'll do that too. Got those too. <laughs> so into the dress. How yeah. in this, I mean, that is ingenuous. Unbelievable. I should have injected some estrogen to that. Yeah, I should have came with all the women here. Well, how come I didn't know about this? Not that I would buy one because I can't. But I usually know about a lot of stuff. I did not know about this I know, I know because, I, because I'm a lawyer and I don't. <laughs> I need someone to help me market. Well, make a slide. <laughs> make me a slide. I, have, I do have a website. I have Instagram. I have all that stuff. So I've, yeah. And I've actually. Are you actually someone I've doing it? Created an amazing website. I have an affiliate program. It's so all you set got, up. You just I'm just ready to go. go. That's well, it. Yeah. let me tell you, this kind of feels good. <laughs> Second softest feel thing you've ever felt. It feels very good. sit there all day now? Unless <laughs> <laughs> you need a little vibrator in there. And oh. <laughs> oh, I just never saw anything like that. I bet awesome. men get a kick out of this. I mean, they just might, <laughs> the men might just buy this. What they don't, don't know. know. Won't hurt them. I don't know about that. Right? Yeah. Yes. Again, how do if they anything, reach you? How do they see your items? Dress, well, the dresses are at Sculpt... <laughs> they're called Sculptura. Sculptura? Sculptura. Sculpture with an A. Right. The tour is the website. And these are Sculptura... Sh sculpt it your way shapewear dresses. Sculpt yeah, it your way. Now, let's say you made it for a big woman. sculpt it your way. Yes. If you made it oh. for a big woman, well, you, you don't have to well, make it three times the size of the butt. <laughs> well, you know what? A larger woman, someone who's curvier, doesn't doesn't need that. Oh. Yeah. But the rest of the dress... I'm trying to figure out how to take it away. You're adding. <laughs> well, see, no dresses do that. They don't. Everything is separate, right. and they're very uncomfortable. Well, yeah, yeah, one day you might want a butt. Nah. One day maybe you don't. Yeah, yeah depending on where you're going. That's well, you true. Well, that's the having thing. a cushy seat. Yeah. Right? But you yeah. know what, Valentina? This is the whole thing. Look, if I put on this necklace, right, and I put on these earrings, and I put on these, look, I have my gold but bag that Tony you know, gave me, oh, and I have FMPs? my shoes. Do you have FMPs on? What's, what is it? Well, back wow. in my day. These you are, know what they were called, these? No. FMPs. Fuck me. Oh, yeah. fuck me pumps. No, I didn't know that that was a thing. Yeah. <laughs> That's what they were called. You're on it. Oh, well, listen, guys, we're You're at on the, the air. end. Yeah. I know, yeah. but it's my show. Of, okay. <laughs> <laughs> listen, we're getting to and the, the end. And the toys of, of oh, Valentina. Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> so listen, oh, where do they call you? Uh, the, uh, Windows of the <laughs> <laughs> windowsofthelake.com or anthonyslive.com if you want to yeah. come for the shows and things that we're doing. But okay. for the events that we have at Windows, like Mother's Day, Easter, and stuff like that, which is coming up as well, Mother's Day, big, another, so just like Easter, mm -hmm. just like Thanksgiving. That's great. That's uh, windowsofthelake.com or just call us at 631 737 0088 or 1 800 23 events. Get okay, and how about power. you? We're running out Go of time. Go to powerwomenofexcellence.com or powerwoe.com. And now, you, we got to get this yeah. dress out there. <laughs> Forget about it. Yes. And if They're somebody's a lawyer, <laughs> listen, if you, if, you wanna, <laughs> if you want to do a fashion show, let me know. We'll talk about it. We yeah. do it on the We do the events. Yeah. You know what? See, that's the beautiful thing. Women are so multifaceted. Mm -hmm. We have, we are who we are in, inside, but we have different careers, different likes, right. different hobbies, mm -hmm. different things we do. Juggling Nothing little. defines us. And the law firm, I mean, obviously you do all kinds of stuff. Yes. So yes. tell your uh, bosses about this. Well, they're going to watch it, I'm sure. I don't I very well could. And not only do we, we do this, but we do, like, the whole industry of your firm. Like, whoever mm -hmm. is your accountant, who is your mm -hmm. closer, and then you get the whole show for one hour. Mm -hmm. And it's yeah. not a bad deal. Northwell Hospital likes it. They do it um, for an hour because then That's great. Yeah. they all connect it and mm -hmm. they get very it all nice. done. One, two, three. And everybody, you got to go see Dominic on the corner at Leonardo's Pizzeria. Yeah. Okay. And ask for the Valentina pizza. Okay. And oh, then yeah, he'll Valentina. know I sent you. I need Yummy. to know what's on it, though. Yeah. Yeah. What's on the Valentina pizza? It's like a grandma. Okay, good. Okay. Yeah, it's like a grandma. <laughs> it's like a grandma or is a grandma? Well, I am a grandma. <laughs> You're, I mean, you're a glamour. When, when I went in there, right, mm -hmm. and I said, you know, uh, why don't you come on the show? He goes, well, what are you going to do for me? I'm like, whatever you want. And I said to him, you see these things here? My, yes. my, 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 uh, what am I looking pants. at here? This. this. Yes. <laughs> Put it on every pizza for me. Mm -hmm. He goes, that's, that's a lot of work. 
work up much. I'll do it. I'll bring a kid in to sing. So he's thinking about it, and that's okay. how this all came up. <laughs> but he well, makes great soups. Can I just soups. say about my new book coming sure. out? Sure. Yes. What, what is it My about? new book is on sales. It's called Sell Smarter, Make More. Nice. The only sales book you'll ever need to read. Really? So, so be, when is that coming out, out? It should be out within the next month or two. So you're having a book launch, I'm sure. It's going to be only an ebook. Okay. So I will have some sort of launch online. Online, that's good. Um, and it's yeah, I'm excited about too. it. It's it's a, it's a great book. It's only 33 pages. <coughs> you do not need wow. to read 200 pages on how to sell. Okay, less, so less but you can more. do talks oh, about I'm, it. Yeah. And we can have a little event. Like, I'm updating a whole. We new can have website. a whole thing like going, you do yeah. something, me, you. We mm -hmm. can do a few things. So Tanya, Tanya, how do you sign that? Ebook. <laughs> I'm going to sign digitally. it digitally <laughs> online. Okay. Yeah. Either that or it'll, have, it'll have my name there. But it's, it's print on real. demand. Yeah, you know what? I, I didn't want to do print. No. It's such well, a small book. Mm -hmm. that, it is small. And you don't you have know, to. The 30, today. 40 pages, mm -hmm. you just, I don't need to. Um, so, yeah, it's an ebook. But it'll, yeah. it'll, that ebook will. So You'll slam, make other bam, things you, kind from of thing, right? it. Yes, so, yes. You get the point and then you whatever. can go into corporate. Yeah. Well, I'm going to help people right. write their sales and marketing materials. Well, you're going to help your best friend here. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying. That she is. We're talking well, we about that when we leave here. The little we're black dress. <laughs> yeah. We're thinking about it, yeah. And then when she does the bu the bus, you know, the big size yeah. woman, the big black dress. The big black dress. <laughs> hey. <laughs> or, the bi or the big That's black it. bus. Oh, yeah. boy. Wow. <laughs> the bus. We went or the big black bus. Black butt. What? <laughs> I mean, you have a lot of, you know, all you have to do is put three creative yeah. women together and yeah. boom. A lot of alliteration. Yeah. Sure happens. <laughs> and then you have an, a grand opening one night of yeah. those three things. You yeah. can have a lot of men in the audience. Well, when you launch a book, my book's coming out after that. But that's still, okay. a, that's. What's that about? It's, it's actually a, a lifestyle kind of how a professional woman can maintain a healthy lifestyle. Because who has time to exercise? Who yes. has time to eat, go to the store and buy healthy food? Who has? So it's an acronym, self-aware, and it it's just whatever. One day. That's great. That's great. Soon. Well, you're going to yeah. self-publish? Yes, definitely. Okay. Probably self-publish. I, I don't need to, like, like what you Tanya just said. You need a publisher. Said. I have one. I work yeah. with yeah. Red Penguin. So we're going we're gonna to do that. Because you know what? I think um, a healthy lifestyle is very important. And we, we do. Ain't nobody got time for that. Like, no, who has yeah. time? No, it's true. It's so true. chair Pilates, doing stuff in your office, things like that. Right, which mm. is great. Yeah. I'll be the first and, one to read it. Yeah. And you know what? My birthday's next week. I'm turning 59. Wow. Oh, oh yeah. look at her! Woo! And uh, so it's awesome. it's about just maintaining this life, you mm -hmm. know. And, and I don't. It's I don't about do injections. Day, right? I don't do any of that yet. But uh, I'm not. I've no, no problem with it. But I don't. <laughs> you know, it's just living a healthy life. Yeah. So. Well, that's great. Well, you're and beautiful. Being a professional. I'm so Thank glad you. I get to meet you. Thank you. Somehow we're going to do something together. Sure. Feel it in my bones. Yes. yes. You yes. know. And. Power. Uh, yeah. Power it's the women. power of the women. Yeah. The three yeah. amigas. Right. Yeah. I actually wrote a short story about the three amigas. Did you? Yep. Oh, okay. We were working on the uh, crimes against internet children. Okay. Three girls. And I have a short story about it. Yep. Cool. I do. I never did anything with it, but it's still on my computer with a lot of other things. See, like you know what? See, I'm the founder of the National Organization for Women's Safety Awareness. We raise awareness about violence against women and teens. Somehow we should talk about that as well. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a And I help yeah. people with fibromyalgia, because I have it. Mm -hmm. And the best thing you can do you for know? fibromyalgia is get up, get dressed, and show up every yeah. day. Yep, yep. Because it's not yes. that bad yep. unless you let it be that bad. Right, right. right. And 30 right. years ago, they told me that I had the doctor's wife's disease. Because it really? wasn't a disease then. Oh. Now people are on disability with it. Hmm. Really? Interesting. Yeah. People oh with God. fibromyalgia, yeah. But again, I didn't, I didn't get in. Mm -hmm. You know. But it's just there's so many things that women are not in tune to, mm -hmm. and that's a shame. <clears throat> yeah. And so, little by little, we're all helping everybody and doing great things. You should do an article in Power Magazine about that. Yeah, I could <laughs> if she would like to someday. Of course. Right? Yeah. Of I mean, course. I so many things. <laughs> I, I can't even tell you. So you're, yeah, you're an you're an amazing woman. Women are juggling it all today. Well, we're you are it. one of them. Well, we have yeah. to, right? Don't we uh, have to? Well, yeah, you have to. Because I tell you, so you have to. Especially hey, wife. the best part <laughs> right now for all. me is your wife does it all. I she have a significant other. He's and ten years younger than me, and he's adorable. Very nice. Awesome. They bought me a pin that says, uh, you know, like when you're a cougar. Cougar. Yeah. <laughs> the girlfriends of mine bought me a cougar pin because That's I funny. met this wonderful man three years ago. Nice. And hey. he's in from Ireland, and 
He's a Nothing wrong with oh, he's that. A great guy. You know. Him. He's a great guy. So he's been great to me. So the Power so. Magazine, you have a guy on that. that I do. Like for the first yeah. time, I had um, a gentleman uh -huh. who is a plastic surgeon. Oh, okay. And his slogan is Empowering Women Through Physical Change, Dr. Pincus. Mm -hmm. yeah. He's in Smithtown. And he was at he's the right gala. He, yeah. he got my Man of the Year. That's yeah. right. Yeah, I, yeah. That's why he looks so and, familiar. And um, he's, he's just great. Really great doctor, um, great person. Well, we this also want to, yeah, we want to thank uh, Randy Frieda. You guys are going to have some great photos. You'll get yeah. it in about two weeks. Okay. He Thanks is Randy. a wonderful. Randy's shy. Yeah. Right? He's always following me. He likes following to be behind the camera, but not in front of the camera. Come in front of the camera. <laughs> say hello. I show his picture. He doesn't well, really. Say hello. Say hello, I do. Randy. Randy's great. Oh, this, is, this, is the <laughs> guy, this is the best guy on the planet that you want to know over here, right? And there you go. He's like he's my so best great. friend. Right? He's right? Every here event, I am. He is He is everywhere, this guy. He's so great that he followed me to a restaurant two weeks ago to bring the photos that I gave you. Oh, yeah, no. He's Bonnie, amazing. come up for a second. Come back, I, back I up. I actually forgot to plug something. Okay, else. sure. <laughs> if you don't have plans for tomorrow, uh, come in here. Come, come, down? Come, come, yeah. <laughs> you Just have, sit on his If you don't have plans for tomorrow, I'm going to be at Governor's Comedy Club in oh. the Giggles Room. Terry McNeely uh, is the producer and he is the headliner. Oh, so Terry's, Terry's at 8 o'clock. And thank you. That's about it. Well, <laughs> you can stay now. Look, we're almost there. I want to hear something Here's funny. Ellen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you have to pay for that. What is that? that? What is that <laughs> That's Ellen in Aruba. Nope. Is this just for her? <laughs> yeah. that off this the camera. Oh, no, I got plenty for That's him. So I just oh, thought okay. you could show because they right, together now. Oh, you want to take it out? I'm going to sit on the line. Here, right here. Oh, there you go. Look at this. Wow, nice. There she is. When was that, Aunt? She was in Aruba and I wasn't. Oh, you're there. What's that? You were there. Two of you. Oh, yeah. We're <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah you no. were drinking a lot. I don't know. One of the events. New Year's Eve. Yeah. Maybe New Year's Eve. Very nice. Very, very nice. I might have been New Year's Eve. I might have been. Ellen, we miss you today. So we'll see you soon. Love you, honey. I know she went away, right? She had to go somewhere, right? No, upstate. Yeah, she had to go upstate, she said. Right. And don't forget, Casariano. Yes. Danny. Yeah. Jericho Turnpike, Mineola. Ask for Danny. Tell him you heard about it on the show. It's big now. Only five people. And you won't be, you'll be, you will be happy when you go there to eat. It is delicious. And the performers are also very good. And, um... I can't say enough about him and about the people I met there. And I love the fact that, you know, you have to have a reservation for the bar. <laughs> I tried to slip in. It doesn't happen. Because yeah, I tried to. They uh, are regular. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, they, still, yeah, they don't they do happen. that. And I, I respect that. They don't that. push over over there too much. No. <laughs> you talk about integrity. He does have integrity, Danny. Yes, yeah. definitely, definitely. And it's important, especially yeah. so does Anthony. You know, when you're in the restaurant, <coughs> the restaurant business is not an easy business. No. You can, no, you no, know no, that. I don't know how you do what you do. 48 years of it Really, now. Yeah. you know. Well, looks but like mostly wedding catering now. That's like a brand stuff or whatever. The event lighter. business, you know, but the people that actually, you know, shop you and come you and all, all, they're always there supporting you. I mean, those are the people you have to take care of. You know? Absolutely. The ones, the ones that just stop by, they eh, just want to check it out, see what it is, and they go. You know, a lot of times they don't they don't keep on coming back. But right? the because event far or whatever. Back. But the people that keep on coming back, those are the ones that you're going to, like, coddle and keep, whatever, because <laughs> they're, they're always there. Your yeah. friends, and they support yes. you through thick and thin. COVID, yeah. and whenever everybody was coming, you yeah. know. That uh, that no wedding, so they all came out to support me in the restaurant. So it was amazing. And events so. are back. Yeah. Because yeah. I lost my job back. in publishing. You know, 18 years ago, mm -hmm. because print was dead, events mm -hmm. went down. Yeah. And mm -hmm. that was it. Yeah. Now it's all turned around. Right. Yeah. And print is not dead anymore. Mm -mm. But online is better, and social media. Well, is the well big guess thing. what? Yeah, People both. don't understand how expensive it is to print. Well, I do because I, I mean, came from feel the business. Like, feel this quality. Well, well, I know what Canada, right? I know that. Yes. <laughs> you said the Canada to get a print. Yeah, no, I, I should. Because Mike Catino used to do that. You know, Mike used to have like magazines. I remember him. I get this printed right on Well, then you know Fran. You know Fran Catino. Then she was. I know everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fran is my friend. Yeah. Fran's yeah. been around forever. She's been doing that other magazine. It's his with, right arm. Um, you know? Nightlife. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And Nightlife what's her magazine, name? Yeah. Uh, the one that moved far, far away. Uh, she had a magazine. Yes. Um, what's her name? I forgot her name. Oh, uh, my Pulse. Yes. Oh, Pulse. Pulse. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Pulse. Yeah. Yeah. The Newsday Girl. Wait, yeah. what was the Russian name? Yes. The, 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 the cable Russian name. Girl, right? Yeah. Tatiana. Yeah. No. Chuck I was going to say. What was her? It was I forgot her name. Nadia. No. Nadia. Nadia. Nadia was very popular. Yeah. Yeah. 
So well, she had a lot of financial what you, Wait, how do they watch you? Uh, How's that working out right? for you like that? Yeah, anyway. are you okay? <laughs> My legs. <laughs> I'm not going to I'm gonna have to do sit down you get, comedy you're tomorrow to instead down. of stand not up. Stand up. Flat um, down. I just go to on Facebook. Uh, I have a public page. That's comedy. My name, Bonnie Scalisi, mm. S C A L I S I. And I post fun stuff on there. And then I have a my own show that it's just my own thing. Yeah, but it's it, better. I your call own it thing. my initials Bonnie Scalisi, so you get the idea. And I have not just comedians, but I have, um, you know, people with different walks of life. I take the camera with me. I go to Atlantic City with me. I just like <laughs> kind of I show she goes up my to Atlantic sons. City. I, and she I drink the camera access. and shows everybody. I show the suite. It. <laughs> it's just for fun. Mm -hmm. So and then I put on my all my comedy uh, shows and information on my Facebook page. I have an Instagram, but I don't know what I'm doing on I'm Instagram. learning to use it a no little bit. No idea. Yeah. So but I'm not, not even good with bother. the Instagram. The, I had the easiest it. way to do it is to actually do Facebook, and it actually just mirrors whatever you're doing on Facebook. Yeah, you just oh. got to learn it more. It, that's know? all. I'm learning. I learned a lot. It's just the tags and whatever the kids don't yeah. I, so it, I use it as a photo holder. Yeah. <laughs> so all right. <laughs> well, so everybody, we need you to share, like the show, tell your friends, all your friends. Yeah. Everyone mm -hmm. at that big company, share and like. Yes, I will take Well, you have yes. employees. Yeah. Yes. And you have what about thirty employees or fifty? I have a ton. I, I, well, this is like during the winter time, but then we go up to like a hundred employees. We do all yeah. service catering. We yeah. do the air show at the beach for, for yeah. BMW. We, we, and we, the white event. Everywhere. Did you guys go to the white event? Yeah, no. Crazy. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. On the beach. Was, that was Denisha. Yeah. yeah. The, yeah white event. the pop up yeah. white event. Yeah. Yeah. Crazy. Well, where 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 was that? This that was in the park. We, where was that? Where was the park? The oh, Roslyn Park yeah. or something like that. And, uh, I went I to the one in the city. I didn't go to the one on Long Island. It was very nice. I wore oh, black no, pants, yeah, so it was a problem. You wore what? Black <laughs> pants. <laughs> it was a white You're supposed party. to wear right all water. white. But I said, nice. you don't want me wearing white pants. <laughs> 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 they let me in. The, all right? They lie to us a lot because, you know, they, why do they call it a white party? <laughs> because, no, So you do. wear black. So I wore black pants with a white top. They let me in at the end. But they're very serious. Yeah, of, oh, yeah, course. of course. They really said, yes. you can come in. I'm like, I drove far away. I have to anyway, come in. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. But they all look beautiful, I got to tell you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Everyone looked beautiful. And the food was great. Anthony did the food. And Brad Cohen, he's just yeah, Brad. My Brad. too much. We love him. <laughs> well, he was the uh, the mascot guy. For uh, the mascot. The, the, I know. What do you want to call him? He's... Uh, Master Sherman. Master Sherman. Master Sherman. Master Sherman. Master Sherman. Everybody, we're, we're, Thanks, Randy. I appreciate we're it. We're coming to a close. <laughs> this yeah. show Thanks, is now He's like, this on is going to be great. This is going to be great. <laughs> we now have our show on Optimum Tuesdays at 11. Oh, yeah. So this cool. show is on regular Optimum TV channel 115 Tuesday. Wow. Very nice. That just happened <laughs> thanks to Bobby Lacerra. Oh, right. This great. man is a saint. You need anything, call Bobby. Tell him what you need. If it's a small event, a small event, a big event, just a video. Look at this place. It's amazing. And so was he. I'm very happy that and we so were you, up to well. 11 because <laughs> otherwise, you know, all the other channels, I got my cable vision downgraded. <laughs> and so at least I know I have that within well, the circuit. The I saw it yesterday. I'm like, I, Tuesday I was home because I wasn't feeling yeah. good. And I watched it. I'm like, shit, this is nice. I it think I right. go up to 100. <laughs> that's about that's it me. <laughs> <laughs> so now I don't have to explain to everyone how to watch the show. Right. Because, you know, the Italians, you know, the older people, they can't do it. <laughs> There's no <laughs> way they can't do it. You got to go with your phone and show them. Right, right. exactly. So, so when this is here on Tuesday, on, on Tuesday, we'll be on Tuesday, one fifteen, okay. eleven o'clock. Oh, very cool. And on that note, I think we're pretty close to the end. Thank you for having me. Yes. Thank you for coming. You're always a doll. I love, love what you, you do with the seniors. She takes the seniors to the diner and buys no, some breakfast. No, no, no. <laughs> well, that's I, where I, I saw you. You always say that, but I belong to it. My mom had Alzheimer's. And it, I belonged to a support group, and after mm -hmm. the meetings, we would go to the diner. Right. Uh -huh. I didn't, you know. But <laughs> I was there. part of the support group. Yeah. She's you know. taking get everybody's you sugar. You supporting them. <laughs> she was putting everyone's <laughs> coffee together, and I'm like, this is so Yeah, we ran into do. each other at the diner. And that's when we really Thank became friendly. Me. We got friendly there. Then I walked into Governor's, and she's right there. <laughs> I was green in there. I didn't know what I was doing at Governor's. <laughs> Same. <laughs> I didn't stay that long, but I did learn a lot. And I thank Joe, who got me in there in the beginning. Yes. Mm -hmm. But, uh, and then some of them talk about kind of things that are, not you, but you know, some of the men, they get a little raunchy. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to, I'm going to please. Talk in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> but you, don't, you don't do that. You don't do that. You're a gentleman. <laughs> so, um, 
I don't know. The clock seems to be not working right. What does it say? It's past. It's I 23 think, minutes past. I, I think, yeah, 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 I think you should, I think it's over. It's yeah. 23 well, minutes that past your hour. That's over time. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so yeah. we, cl we close? Up. Times, I told you. Yeah. I'm in uh, trouble. Okay. All right, Good night, that's everybody. a wrap. Bye, Bye guys. Bye, guys.